Hadaway averaging 12 points a game and shooting nearly 60%. Now both of these teams are facing the rest versus rust scenario and lead. Kyle Lofton double teamed and lost it. Turned it over. Came to Carter Collins, then moved ahead and laid in by Kellen Gray. Top of that, scheduling it at Dayton gives them the ability to then take all the teams that will be going to Indianapolis, put them on a bus, and get them there within a couple of hours right from hotel. Two games up. Those will both take place at VCU. Lee feeds it in tight. They kick it out for a look at three. And it's good. And seven three-pointers. Just those three guys have hit more three-pointers than 92 teams in the country have hit. Wow. You know who that makes happy is Steph Curry. <laughs> at another one. This is now for Vasquez. Off the rim. Lee. He's starting to heat up. As Welch back into the game. Can't get the shot to drop, though. But good to see Dominic Welch out there shooting for St. Bonaventure after he limped off the floor earlier in the half. Just over four minutes to go. Kellen Grady. Another yeah, without question to me, Cal Grady deserves to be all league again. And let's enjoy the work of number 31. <laughs> A subdued approach. Vasquez thought about it, thinks about it again. No good. The ball back to Davidson. Kellen Grady goes right to the hoop and uses the glass. 9-2 on the offensive end and 12-2 on second chance, points, second chance points for St. Bonaventure. Michael Jones for Bates Jones. Unrelated. Although Jones does come from quite the athletic family as this is... Throw ...attempts. They're very much been living on the perimeter. That could be dangerous as this game goes on. Hoffman, the freshman, at 16 points on Friday against Southern Virginia. Bochi Edom sets it up for Grady. I was talking to him, I said, do you just say, hey, hey, Kyle, we'll see you at halftime when you send him out there to start the game? He says, no, I just see him after the game. <laughs> but he averages, you know, 38-plus minutes per game as Lee. Why not? He's in a game on Sunday against Dayton to close out the regular season. Man, I hope that happens. <laughs>